Navigating New York's concrete jungle can be dangerous. Imagine doing it blind. There's always that little bit of uh, apprehension in terms of how, you know, is it safe to cross? Albert Catullo has never been able to see. Crossing the street, trapping traffic with his ears isn't always safe. All of a sudden, someone, a car would come out of nowhere, and it's like, what do I do now? What he can do now at 21 intersections in the city is listen for this. It will lead him to this button. When it's safe to cross, he'll hear this. And feel a vibration, sending a message to even those with hearing impairments and other disabilities that it's safe to walk. We are literally making sound investments in the safety uh, for all New Yorkers with these audible pedestrian signals. City leaders announced Wednesday in the next year they'll add 25 more intersections to the 21 already covered by these accessible pedestrian signals. Audible signals allow the blind in reality to see. The 25 audible pedestrian signals will be installed at the most dangerous intersections in the five boroughs. Here in Chelsea at 23rd Street and 7th Avenue, from 2005 to 2009, 21 pedestrians were injured, one of them died. This is a very high traffic corner for seniors. Officials will also direct the new devices to dangerous intersections frequented by more of the visually impaired. These signals are a real breakthrough in, in terms of helping blind people be able to cross independently and safely. It's an investment advocates for the disabled say is worth it. They just want to see the more than 11,000 other intersections included. Michael Hertzenberg, New York One.